So now we are going to loser's final. So we are going back to three out of five. This is going to be Balbury versus Master Moose. So we can jump to the back of the queue, but I'm going to change the lounge settings to first to three again. Three out of five. So first to three, go into the back of the queue. Uh, David, let's jump to the back of the queue. Okay. Because that's the other thing, too, is a lot of people are coming here into this chat and they're referring to him by his first name, by his, you know, his, his, his government name. Which to me just kind of indicates that you know he's got a pretty strong fan base and 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 uh, seems to have a really uh, oh yeah Nathan is definitely one of the most handsome for sure. Look at this boy. Look at this boy. Look, you notice how he just like melds into the cat bed. Look at this thing, dude. Oh uh, yeah, it's we have so a very similar cat bed and our cats <laughs> do the very similar position. He just melds right, melts right into it. That's hilarious. That's a good little baby. Oh, yeah. All right. So it's a battle of the bisons. And this is this is a fun one, in my opinion. I used to play a lot of Dictator, and I used to play a lot against Boxer. And it, I think it's a really fun match. It's a match in which both have really strong offense, really strong plus frames. Just a question of which one gets things going. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Crouching Fierce. Oh, oh my god. Anything for the kill. Mm, 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 mm. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Not like this. Oh, Ross uh -oh. slide. The bomb. Oh. Someone set us up the bomb. Uh -oh. oh boy, I would be reversal that down forward fears for sure. Oh, good block, but here we uh -oh. go. Uh -oh. Dude, this is coming all the way back around. Oh, yeah, I course. can't believe this. this. Look for the B skill, my man. That's all. Oh, yes, I love it. Plus, yep, yeah, that's minus. Oh. Oh. No, that was minus. You're absolutely right, James. It could have been Master Moose's turn. It yeah, could have been. Remember, there were also many down forward fierces, which could have been Beer Reversals to escape that situation. Yeah, you have to remember, Light Scissor Kick is minus four on block. So if you block light scissor kick close up, go for something. Uh, if you block heavy one, it's minus two. You can't punish him, but it's still your turn. Only EX scissors is the move that you have to respect. But that was a beautiful comeback there for Balbo. Yeah, oh yeah. Well done. Yeah, yeah, and what's great about that is that it wasn't just like one V-trigger, it was quite an extended series yeah. of getting a lot of things right. It was just super cool. Is that a Look counter first, hit dash punch right there for Moose? He's gonna have to try to learn to read the counter hit so we can get the light punch into dash punch combo afterwards. Mmm, I like the interrupt. Yeah, wake up buttons. Missed the meaty, but you know, sometimes those buttons are plus five on whiff, dude. And there we go, the low gonna take that round one to one. Dude, this is Yeah, this that is one of the better post throw buttons in the game. Many characters have a button that they like to hit after a throw tech. And that one's a good one for sure. Great range and speed. Oh, air to air. Okay. Too far for the throw. I like that neutral jump, and I think he tried to dash up back throw there to try to switch the sides. So good tech from Balbury. Or escape check. I think it was a check, not a tech. Mm -hmm. Okay, back throw. Did he do Psycho Axe? Well, he hasn't done Psycho Axe after back throw a lot. I don't, know, I don't know if that's something Balbury is aware of. The, the back throw. What was that? Back throw and a psycho axe. He hasn't done that oh. a lot. No, I'm sure that. Well, I guess we'll see. Oh, I love Okay, see. giving up here. Ah, <laughs> see, that's one situation where I think it makes a lot of sense. All you yeah. need is one more hit. You have a life lead. If he gets hit, he would probably still have built another. V bar right? anyway, right? I mean, it wasn't like he had lost his only chance to build a V meter. So I like that a lot. I think that was yeah. smart. Not Great defense. Re and Bison is really strong at turning defense into offense really quickly, like you just saw. Yeah, that V reversal was clutch. Without that V reversal, he wouldn't have had that little mix up on that fireball set up there. So, yeah, just got to learn to use those things when you have a life lead like that. Moose is definitely ready for jumps. Regular jump ends have not been working for Balbury. Yeah, especially with Bison, who's floaty, floaty to the max, you know. You floaty to the max. I Here we go. Like that. There was a psycho axe. Could use that more often. Yeah, away. That's what I'm talking about. 
Ooh! Ooh, <laughs> out of the, that's not plus either, so that throw might have even been a defensive throw. That oh, was so man. good! Yeah! Oh, oh no, the second hit actually whiffed! That was wild! And now, oh, that could have been it. Down four fierce into nothing. I One think that happened. was a combo drop, unfortunately, for Balbury. And, oh, you no. know, I just picture Brian F. just being like, Yep, I've seen that whip a million times, I hate it! <laughs> 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 oh, man. Capcom, what gives? <laughs> there it is. Oh! See that even as a Tatsu hitbox emote. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, Great stand block. Yeah. You know, I met Moose has done a good job at making the overhead low stuff work out. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's why a lot of us were like, could they possibly give Balrog a V-Skill 2 that would be useful? And they did. They did? <laughs> it was shocking. <laughs> Gotta expect, yeah, as I say, EX Ball or V-Skill 2 or Sweep. Ah, okay. Oh, okay, avoids it, but why? Oh, the counter poke. Sometimes you have to go for the frame trap, man. Sometimes you have to go for the pure frame trap. I'm not even sure what I said. Yeah, the challenge is crouching jab instead of stand short, which is the typical option, the three frame option, the fastest option for a dictator. Oh! And I like the walk back yep. defense, though, but good confirm on the crush. Miss the, the dash. Here we go. Just no the party problem. time. But yeah, like you said, party time. That was the chance to party. Oh, too far for the throw. Looking for activate here. Here it was. Love the V reversal to get out. Yeah. Good and stuff. now, oh no, this is unsafe. Oh, but he didn't punish it. Couple of oh, that's it. Oh no. Couple of missed. Yeah, there was a the chance there if Master Moose had responded to the V skill two with the crouching fierce, which we've seen twice. Yes. Then that could have been around in his favor, but because he got hit. That started the downward trend. Well, I don't know if choking is the right word, Moose. You're certainly doing a lot of good stuff up there. Round one. Yeah. It's just a question of keeping it all together all at the same time, which is not easy. Yeah, again, you know, we're in here all having a good time. I don't want anyone to feel like they're choking or whatever like that. So. Right, right. Yeah, That the point of this is not to feel like everything's on the line, you know? Right. Look. The, the, the point of this is to learn. Yeah, we call this a beginner's tournament, basically meaning that you know, it's not necessarily. We don't want to see. We don't want you to call it choking. We want it so that when it doesn't happen, we can just call it clutch. You know. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, my man. Ooh, it worked out, and here we go, Master Moose pressuring the corner. Yep. Yep. Gotta look for activate. Yeah. Certainly, what the round hustle is going to be about. Mm, just that wasn't a true block string, so he just ate oh, no. that. Okay, that's negative, but. Yep. Oh, mm, not sure what that was supposed to be. Uh, trying to do something as he was waking up, and yep. Balbury pretty consistently in those situations has gone for frame trap button rather than grab. Oh yeah, the yeah. dash. No anti-air. That's definitely something to note. <laughs> They're both heavy trading. And now Master moves the knockdown. Oh, you know what? That's great. Yeah, because that's plus on block again. So that's nice. That, that, that dash punch right there. So going with the stand light kick afterwards is a smart thing to do. Just have to be careful because if they block and you stand light kick, then you're negative off the target combo. Okay, good mm, I don't know. But the walk, even a slow walk speed got him out of that range. You can see boy, if I were Master Moose, I would love to block a few more things right now. Oh, boy. Here we go. Maybe you won't need it. One more. Nice. Okay, he changed up the timing. Ooh. He had gone close short into walk a couple okay. of times. Close short into throw. This time it's into another short. short Very short. nice. Three frame into three frame. Oh yeah. That's what you want to see right there. Again, this is losers finals. Winner goes on to grand finals. Losers is out in third place. And yes, we know for beginners it might be brutal to hear. Uh oh, oh stuns on Zed. Oh, oh yeah. God. 
Oh, yeah. No! Well, okay, we'll see how it turns out, but... That could have been a lot more and a better meaty situation. Well, we've seen Bobbery make the comeback before. You're definitely ahead of me over here, David, so... We're getting spoilers. If this is down for... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Stan Fierce. Oh, okay, there we go. Not too short Stan Fierce? Is that what we saw? Pouch and jab, maybe Stan Fierce? Wow. Interesting, interesting buttons. Dude, don't sweat Maybe it's supposed it, to have been Moose. V-reversal, I don't know. Don't sweat it, Moose. Don't, no, that's not called choking. You won. So that's called yeah. clutch right there. Yeah, that's not even the right term in this case. <laughs> I don't want to hear that word at all, but I definitely don't want to hear it when you win the game. Right. Uh, that's, that's, <laughs> a, that's a James strategy right there. Win a game and be like, I still suck. You know, that's, yeah. that's definitely me. Master Moose. Oh, Look every button's this. nailing yeah. it. And the air to air as well. That's so nice. On there. Hey, someone used that to call me Blames on. Chen, Brozard. They used to call me Blames Chen because everything was my fault. Mm, the block. That, but that's the punish. Yeah. And very consistently, Balbury, I was you mostly been talking about Master Moose. For Balbury, I would say that when those V Skill 2s are blocked. There should be more than just a jab into scissors because that has it can be unsafe and furthermore it's not a maximization of what you could do. You know, if the opponent's respecting you, you could be stealing turns with a roundhouse, you could be getting grabs more. Right. Just go with a standing medium punch. Maybe if, yeah, you, a medium. if you're scared and you really want to test them, do standing light kick into light ball. Right? Because safe right. on block, if they get hit, it's still a combo. A great block. Yeah, but not quite a punish, unfortunately. See, that's minus two. That was the heavy scissor kick. So you gotta recognize which scissor kick you end up blocking. And they're very subtle differences. It's just the speed of startup and the length that he travels forward. You'll get used to it as you watch it a lot. You have to yep. do the same thing against Balrog too, getting used to it. Nice. Very important view reversal to just try to escape some sort of situation. What a tech! And to the other side in the back throw? Oh boy! Whoa. Really, really nice. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying this unarmed oracle, and hopefully if you're new to fighting games, that a lot of the tips and analysis that we're doing uh, help you understand it a little bit more as well. So there you go, Moose tying it up. In his words, he choked it up again, and he's tied <laughs> yeah. it up two to two. Is choked his way into the final game of the set. Yep, exactly. <laughs> and again, he was second place last tournament, too. So, yeah, that's right. Very, very strong play so far. Oh, punished, yep. Regular one of those is definitely punishable. Yeah, for sure, Roan Lore. I mean, a lot of it we're talking about are plus frames, negative frames, and stuff like that. Kind of hard to un. Oh, God, I love that neutral jump to punish the B skill. Sorry. <laughs> I got all excited about that. Yeah, plus means that it's your turn broadly, and negative frames or minus frames means that it's your opponent's turn, sort of yeah. in shorthand. Yeah, basically. That V trigger is still hanging out, and it could be that any slide, yeah, so slide activation, yes, yeah. that's exactly what Balbury was looking for, and finds the hit. Yeah. In so, a, when in, so that was a plus frame situation for Balbury. Yeah. His slide into the V trigger cancel gives him a lot of advantage, and that he used that to get the kill. So match yeah. point now, Balbury. Yeah. Uh, if, uh, right after this, I'll explain a little bit more about like pl what plus or your turn, my turn means. We'll, we'll talk about that a little bit. Um, Great defense here. Balbury building up the gray life as well. <sighs> uh, you know, I think that might be the first time we've seen the EX into throw. V skill into throw. Yeah. Big activation point coming up if he wants it. No, Master Moose trying to take advantage of this thing. Trying to control into the corner. Punish available. Ah, yeah, only yeah. crouching. But that wasn't even a true punish. Crouching medium kick's oh. not fast enough. Oh boy. Here, we go. Here comes the Bobby. The comeback. Oh god. Oh, he was too far away for the throw. <laughs> he was. He was. He oh. was. He has a V trigger ready to activate if he can get it. Oh, no, it doesn't even need it. Downtown. Can you believe the third screen overhead? We're going down to the final round and both in this loser's final match. Let's go. This is a good match. Final game, final round. 
Let's go! <laughs> From downtown! It's good! Oh, nice. there you go. Yeah, punishes that. Yep. Master Moose did some homework on that, and it's coming okay. back to him. Master Moose has the offense now. Gonna just Chopper would love to activate. He would love to get something going here. If he could get a slide, and he goes for it. it. The Psycho Crusher forgot about that. Yeah, there's always that Psycho Crusher once he activates that V trigger, which will frame trap you. Oh, this could be great for Valvary now. He's got yeah, the corner. This is huge. He's got the corner. Back back Master Moose is in big trouble. So smart. Yep. The, oh, big trouble. Got him out of the EX. Time to come off those bars. Yes, he does. Very Beautiful nice. Beautiful V reversal, and he got the jump in. Oh, he tried to walk up. Remember, he did the two light kicks last time. That's a punish. Oh, no. Oh. The unsafe dash punch to seal the deal. And Barlbury into grand finals. <laughs> No, look. Into grand finals. What a match, though. Look, before we even analyze whatever, that was such a good match, everybody. Shoutouts to Valkyrie. Shoutouts to Moose. You guys played it super well. You both had yeah. really strong offense. You both had good defense. There was great reactions. You both were mixing up even in the neutral game. I thought that was excellently well played on both yeah. sides. And Shout I, out to both. Of I know Moose is already kind of cursing the the, 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 the the skies right now, but honestly, yeah. really well done. This top three, two Shoryuken scrimmages in a row. It is very, very good and very, very strong. Nothing yeah. to be sad about. Uh, Dro who's been very helpful here, got three top threes in a row, and maybe four top fours or something like that, has since graduated on to platinum. You know, and he said that this has helped them a lot. Trust me, these things sting, these things hurt, that is the agony of defeat, but that will make you stronger in the end uh, to go through these kind of things. And you know, when you lose a match on ranked like this, you're like, oh, whatever, move on to the next game. But when the tournament's on the line like this, you you feel that now. You feel like I lose and I'm out of a tournament. And understanding that pressure, understanding that kind of uh, situation will make you a stronger player overall. And that's like yeah. really, really super cool. You have a lot of really smart play. So don't beat yourself up at all, Moose Dreams. Great job, great job.